Inside the back seat of this car is where this small pig was left in Avenue Mall parking lot Monday. Miranda Lamandola and her coworker called security after noticing the pig was left in the car in the scorching heat. We noticed the pig is in the car, and of course we're looking to see what's going on. The car is parked with no AC. All four windows only have an inch actually cracked, so not even my arm could actually fit through it. Security told Lamandola they didn't have the authority to get inside the car without the owner's permission. Well, at that point, I called JSO because 45 minutes goes by since I actually videotaped, knowing that the pig has no water, has no food, and he's freaking out. Like, I'm freaking out after 45 minutes of this whole process. Once JSO arrived, they began looking and waiting for the owners to show up. The pig's condition started to get worse. At this point, an hour since I made the video, since I've made the video, this pig has been in here and he's foaming at the mouth. When he foamed at that mouth, I was freaking out. At first, I thought he was actually throwing up, but no, he was foaming. He was shaking, and that's when I turned to the cop and said, he is foaming at the mouth. Can you please break the window? The officer eventually broke the window, freeing the pig. They broke the window, got the pig in the car of the back seat of the cop car. So when we got him there, luckily we had water. So we sprayed that water all along the pig. He finally was responding to us. And at this point, we had to grab more water from inside of the mall, a whole bucket, just so that way he could drink and get himself back to normal. After more than an hour of the pig being left in the car, its owners, Mark Gray and Trinity Tabaras Soto, finally show up and were arrested on animal cruelty charges. Lamandola says she's grateful she helped save the pig. I was so happy because this pig is so cute and adorable. So it was just, it was very gratifying knowing that I was able to save a life because it was going to die.